Hey, my ego's been out of control. It's been out of control. Just hit me like a freight train. I was watching, I was reading these responses, some of these text comments that I had to this this video I made to McCain and uh, there's nothing wrong with ego but as soon as it starts to dominate things then that's a problem I gotta remember how I began why I'm doing this it's about the people it's not about me it's about you know, I was going around telling people, I think you're afraid, you're afraid, you're afraid, I see your fear, I see your fear, and then I stopped, and I like, had this kind of this shift, and I started talking about how it's, it's my fear, it's not, it's not your fear, it's my fear, it's my fear, and then it became about the ego, and it was about me, and my experience, my fear, overcome my fear, and I, me, I can do everything. There's an ant crawling right here, right now. Hello, ant. So that's like, I don't want to, I'm not going to, I don't want to tell other people that they're afraid. I feel weird doing that nowadays. Because like, if I take it a step further, then it's, it's something in me. I guess it's both, and my ego is, God, my ego, like, I'm not anything, I have no ex expectations, I keep saying, I'll talk to you soon to these political people, and someone was like, what do you think, they're going to actually talk back to you, they haven't talked back to you, is your manifestation failing, I'm so sick of the word manifestation, you know how many people say it to me, it's like, I I don't I don't know. I got to I got to reconnect to the pe the people on YouTube. I haven't made any video responses to people in a while. I started I went off on this crazy ego trip. It's powerful to go on an ego trip. Cuz people really get into it and they're like, "Oh, this guy's something." This guy is, let's listen to him. Like the president is going on an ego trip to be the president. That's all about him. I know he wants to help, but who gives a fuck if you're the president? I'm helping just by being, just by, just by being myself, by, by, by trying to like do good things for me, then that helps if I show people. That's what, that's what my, my focus is. It's not, to, it's not to be president. It's something that I will do is run for president, but I'm not, it's, it's not, I, just because I want to. It's something I want to do, just like I wanted to move to Los Angeles and buy a car. I always said I wanted to, so I did. And I want to. I want I want to do it. But it's not about that. I don't care. I have no expectation about what happens. I want to just, I want to use this technology to help people the best way I can. And I think the best way I can help people is to change myself to be more positive and to show people and like telling stories about what I did isn't really cutting it it's it's second it's second you're getting it second wind like if I tell you about how I went to my grandma's house today that's not it that's not what you want to see well I'm assuming that but it's not as interesting as if I took a camera over there and you watched me communicate with her and that's what people, I th that's what I want. How do you do that? I can't videotape, I can't record my own experience, so I need to have like someone else there with me to record me doing stuff. And then it's about the ego again. It's about me being on camera. It's about me. Do Of course it's about me, it's me. But it's about... about making less videos? Is it about taking a hiatus from YouTube because I'm buried so deep in it? Like, 
maybe I'll I'll think about it I'll really think about it I'm not gonna make any grand sweeping statements about anything I'm so tired of I'm not really kind of frustrated frustrated about doing this alone because I'm not doing this alone but I feel like I'm doing this alone you know what I mean like why why do I feel like that why do I feel like I'm doing this alone because I'm not because like I have so many friends and I have family it's amazing family and but I guess it's it's my experience so I have to do my experience alone and like does everybody feel alone do you feel alone do you feel like you're stuck, like, doing it? You gotta do it all on your own, and, like, it's so overwhelming. Because that's how I feel. I feel like it's so fucking overwhelming. I guess you get what you put into it. So if I'm, if I'm just getting on here and talking about stuff to myself, then that's what I'm gonna get back. I'm not gonna get other people. Like, Terry, I haven't even talked to you, dude, in fucking two months since your dad died. I've been, like, afraid of confronting it. And, and today I saw death. I saw... I saw people. Many people. My friend, George. I just found out four days ago that he had contracted spinal meningitis. And I went over... My friend Josh's dad, Josh. And I went over to see him today. And he was sick. In bed. And we talked for a long time. And I'm afraid of, of death because I haven't experienced it. But I'm not... Here I go again. There I go again. I just start. I don't expect anything. I don't expect you to do anything. I don't expect you to, to like me or to hate me or to even to talk to me. I don't. I just gotta keep going. I gotta, I gotta keep going and do something new. When I get back to LA, I'm gonna do something more proactive. <laughs>